Side set on A. Mm, fight the walls, making things a little bit more awkward. And while Demon One has just met the Turkish aim, first bullet straight to the head as they look to swarm in onto Jorgamo. Almost manages to get a double straight off the bat. He is going to be a menace throughout this match on the A site. But for now, at least, it is going to be the advantage in the favor of Foot. A quick retake being attempted, though. Yeah, just trying to annoy them. Some damage done. Bustio able to catch off. Bajan goes out for a bit more. Ooh. That double might just give them a fighting chance in this. With low HP on out of captain, the round might just be theirs. And seconds later, it is locked in for EG. America's number one. Around this corner, that singular smoke place to try and deter them. But Kiwi's going right through it, and he'll find that opener. Yeah, spotted Bustio on the way through. That's your killjoy down. A lot of your utility down and out. I already used a nano swarm. Now a lot of the weaker weapons are trying to skirmish for this site and the op still miles away if you lose these other players you're going to start to think about saving uh, but ethan might just have given them a chance now they can contemplate fighting for this kiwi incredibly so low. low 40 hp a shot out from the op now they know where kiwi is they've got him boxed in taken down and mr fallen's on 70 the follow through round from foot this should have been clean the op didn't even play that big of a role but it might to close it out it has the angle up top, that smoke soon to fade, and Mr. Fallen left in the open, good damage done. Jogamo barely holding on to life, but he'll catch the angle up above. And we saw this recon through in the previous round, this time, oh my, it's catching a lot of information. But the follow through, okay, Jogamo's got his second, here comes the Hunter's Fury. Tagging them up on the way through, making them a little bit easier to follow up on as Jogamo catches yet another kill. And it's the rest it's of, the, of the ultis that went through. Again? And this guy, Bustio, another kill, just spamming through smokes. It's Mr. Fallen to go down this time, and the immediate response from Foot. They're quickening the pace. They're moving into the B side now, hidden oh, here. Oh, a smoke. Still Bustio behind the smoke. <laughs> this is where he's most deadly. Going to be blinded up again. A flash through. It's caught him, and they found him. Rooted him out. In the meantime, though, out of captain. Deleted. Has come through the entirety of EG already and raring to go, but Kiwi's at least even things up for a second. Yeah, and now look at his HP down to 16. Shock darts hunting down both of these low Ooh. players. Maj found Kiwi has to turn up. Only good for the one. Cracks tries to fade away. Dodging bullets. Just one needed to take him down. He is so desperately low. And they're coming so close to finding him. The button seen up above. A lot of counts utility in an attempt to try and slow them down. Lockdown even available as well for Bustio if he decides to use it. And Hunter's Fury has said, calm. He always finds something. And with the lockdown in tow, Ada Captain has at least found one. Not quite clearing Ethan, but even still, they keep the advantage for a moment. Yeah, neck and neck, at least, with Foot grabbing the plant. Orbital strike used, so not online. It's just a blade storm that's charging in and Ooh. taken down. Shot out of the sky by Cracks, but there's a response. Calm, not letting this one slip. Oh my god, the damage is incredible. Cracks down to just a sliver of health. Now the last man standing, double peaked and dealt with. A triple for Ethan. Absolutely no support. He needs to be a hero here, but he's not even Ooh. checked on. He's managed to find a couple, of course. The second player in Cracks can be brought back from the depths, but that's gonna take time. And that time gives a moment. Look at Demon One, he's trying to watch for that exact position. The spam does a lot of damage, and then Ethan finds him anyway. Hoping to get both. The play out. Ethan, no flashes. They gotta just dry peek those angles, lose a lot of HP in the process. Demon 1 down low, doesn't stop him from eliminating Maj. They still need to root out Mr. Fallen, who's just swung out wide, looking to take the fights. Lockdown in play, on the way. The swing needs to come in, Mr. He's Fallen. It's it. being diffused right under his nose. And timing here could be everything. No one's watching it. Yeah, he's, he's looking back and forth, but he's in second oh! back. I, I don't know how Maj has managed to get away with that one. And now, Orbital Strike leaves Com dead to rights. Finally a chance once again, but then strikes Ethan. Another one coming up for Bustio, but it's left all onto Jorgamo. The player wrapping back around, foot have an advantage once again. Oh, the spam is ridiculous, but Moj. Imagine, they're a little late to the party. Now on B long, there's a couple players coming down. Will they even read that? Will there be anyone left alive to read it? Low HP now stuck in the corner. Demon One's also been tagged up, but that won't stop him yet again. Able to deliver kill after kill. The shutdown is there with a back and forth for foot, but they're overextending into this. Knowing the spike needs to be planted, they try to interrupt Ooh. it and well, he's commit Demon One to this as he seeks out a fight. Maj is forced back. There's a player up above in the form of Mr. Fallen. He's on the edge of the smoke. Hasn't come, come through just yet. 
Just spams, that's all he's looking for with his Phantom. No tracers, so good opportunities. Nade out. Oh, Nade is good, and Maj is even better. The spams now going in their favor, and it seems like Foot have found a foothold on this round. Yeah, this is where it gets troublesome. You have to try and reposition and find a safe place to plant, and with all the spams, all the different angles, every player rotating in, that just isn't a safe position. They need someone to give them the fights, and well, the one HP player from the beginning of the round, it would be the greatest clutch ever. 35 seconds left. Uh, they're going to have to make a move eventually, not knowing how many players are on the back of that side towards the elbow. Bustio finds the first. That's Maj. They know that Crax was around here, and they'll deal with him. And with that, well, it looks like a pretty easy side take. Not too many players left alive to spam back, and the plant's already being found. Lockdown if things get very scary, but with only two players that they're up against, and the positions that they've got, I mean, all the control is theirs. They can run this clock right the way down. And there you go, Busio's third seems to lock it in. Nice. To deny at least a little bit longer, but the site is going to fall into the hands. Evil geniuses, Ada Captain trying to make a play through, and Moj will be the one to do it instead. The trade's back, leave it down to just Busio. Still with that operator in hand, and he's going to get destroyed by Kiwi. Try and almost section off into mid, but instead he's getting pressured on the other side. Yeah, and his teammates can't really come out to help just because they're being pressured as well. Kiwi on an island, isolated, you would think, in trouble, but what? Maj manages to buy the time. The orbital strike cut off oh the rest my. of the squad and let this man fight from the hallway. He is decimating the EG squad. Four kills found and foot. Yeah, they've concealed their hand as well. The drone coming around won't spot him out. So Kiwi's able to catch him by surprise. Demon one staying at the bottom. Never on that back. scoreboard, Viper's Pit used. This is great. EG are avoiding the powerful they ult, avoiding seconds, the operator as well, but they've got to be quick. They've got to run head first into this KJ setup. Do they have a knife on the way through? Not online for Crack. Not online for Ethan. Onto the back of the site, the nade is in. It's forcing them out into the open, but they're just taking the fights, winning them as they go. The plan desperately trying to be found. It comes at the cost of Khan's life. Ethan left on the spike all alone and flooded by foot. Factor. Oh. Mobility limited and in fact completely taken away. Kiwi still able to get one, hunted down. Orbital Strike comes Whoa. in. Demon One needs to move quickly. He'll be caught on the way back out. Sure, one kill for foot, but it might not be enough. Out of Captain still with a massive clutch in front of him. The first not even found. Tagging up Bustio. Teammates repositioning. And a lifeline for EG Whoa. with overtime secured. <laughs> Two players here. The expectation of Bustio will be there. The pop flash good. And Demon One is already going to double up. Looking for a little bit more. No trade to be had. Kiwi looking like he was considering going back in here. In the meantime, we've seen the walk up on long, but you can already witness on the map left. that Bustio is firmly watching towards this. It seems like Kiwi trying to maybe bait some sound cues of presence on the other side. And leaving Bustio somewhat alone. He's actually going to go forward, maybe gifting his opponents a chance, but also being a bit of a snake within the grass, not expecting him to be up this close. Ten seconds now for Foot to try and find something within this round. Mr. Farlin, he's got a plant. He's got to go for it right now. No, in fact, there's absolutely no time. Everybody has to die, and it is not going to be happening. Bustio blinded up. Cracks watching, but it's Marge instead, and it's a slaughter! Pressure that B site. More players than usual here, though. EG yeah. stacked up with three, ready for this kind of just sheer muscling of the site. Bustio hasn't been spotted at all, and he's getting them all breaking apart. This attacking side, piece by piece, is third in the round. His idea was to get out there and help his teammate Maj while he was still alive. You know, lock down that extra angle for him and fight for mid together if his buddy was going to be stranded. But once he falls, the correct decision is absolutely to fall back. Holding on to this control a little bit later towards the doors. And we have seen Bustio with a couple nasty flanks. Oh. This time his timing is near perfect and he'll catch two for his trouble. A triple in the round already and a nail in Foot's coffin. Oh. They managed to pick up Jogamo, remove smokes and some utility at least. And they immediately read it. Foot expecting. This EG squad to double back and move left. towards A, and that read could not be better. Oh, timing is everything. He's probably heard the steps of them running all the way back around. Kiwi has the Can perfect flank. The turret still yet to be pulled back for Bustio, so we'll have no knowledge 
at this point. He's been left. spotted. Now looks to maybe run. face back in the other oh, direction, no. but he hits the shot anyway, just taking over this round. It took some time for Evil Geniuses, but the map choice eventually goes their way. Very, very close, just on the edge of that smoke. Oh. Bustio, though, has managed to sneak right by them, and it will obliterate from behind on short. Three kills and two players left in the bathroom. The spike down in the open, and this round already in the hands of EG. Look at the <laughs> repositioning from Calm. I think he might just rob away the potential for that ace to come through. Oh, oh. he's missed the shot, though. Maybe a chance. I don't want to see him get the kill. I want to see Bustio go for the fight, but Calm's being pressured. He won't give up his life for the ace. Had a captain. He's going up against a full lineup of players. He's not going to get anything done there. It's going to be this time out they haven't opted for it actually just sprinting straight down i don't know how they managed to win this early fight with the weaker weaponry but they're gonna be very happy with that one Let's see how much jogamo can get done oh he's gone out wide nade up top it's bouncing back and well it's not even playing a role in that somehow the stinger wins out the fight and eg are looking phenomenal in a round that they should have been able to do some damage in. And instead, they're in a four versus one. An ambitious play from Jogamo and Aero. Zero to counter him, just guessed the wrong place. A lot of utility put out here. I think they're certainly getting the read on this B-side play on the way through. It's going to be ignored as Kiwi makes it to the site. A flank attempt at a round through elbow that's being caught. Jogamo. What? Showstopper got nothing, but the rifle gets two, and the nade would have been enough to close it. Uh, One of them. Oh. He's got his way up behind the entire team. He spotted, though. Cracks knew that he was there. Blast pack good, though. Throws off Maja's aim. And with some support from Bustio, he's gone running through the wall. They've managed to drop the spike. Got some decent control. The flash coming in, an aid on the back of it. And they are seizing control over this spike. It's not going to be given up. Not today. Even running through a nade. They'll get Jogamo his third of the round. And a captain with a 1v2 to clutch out. Hey, Orbital strike online, in. but he's stunned. Oh. One HP. I'm ticking so low. And a captain, he can't move. Oh. He's got to wait for at least a second, but the time is already gone. An early advantage. Potential showstopper for the retake but utility has been used to hold them back a little longer a couple of flashes still for cracks unusual to see that this late into the round so definite potential but we are going to see the lamps being cleared the timing doesn't work out though and a captain finding another kiwi ever crisp and demon one almost just having to look for exit frags he's eventually given the fight but kiwi information 35 seconds left and the nade will be comboed. Looking to come out hookah. There are a multitude of players waiting here. And now Anna Captain has been able to get that orbital strike online. Molly into the corner. They could just try and clear this player out of the tube, but instead they're gonna go doubling back. Demon One now about to be under pressure, just having to jump out of position. He can't quite correct the aim in time. Foot again. They're gonna get their entry and Anna Captain is just tearing this side apart. Kiwi so aware of the flank coming through as well. It is meticulous from foot. Prowler sent through one, but it's on a lurk. And then oh. you just have Maj constantly placing in here. Nice work from Ethan, though. And he does have some what? support. He doesn't even need it. This man seems to be the master of the SMGs. It was the Stinger in the last map, the Spectre in this one. And after a five-round streak, this is the best chance they've had. But Demon 1 will again go amiss as... Mr. Fallen has managed to take him down. But look at what the, the weaponry that EG have brought in. Two judges that'll have to retake if they lose this B-side. I mean, they've got to maintain control. Orbital strike in play. It's causing problems. Ethan's going to be dropped after the one, but Cracks went down to the ulti. Bustio still holding strong on the side. Buys them a little bit more time. And now it's those judges from before. The nade in good position, but he can't follow through. It forces him out of his spot into the open. But that's not good enough with a judge in hand. Four bullets. Mr. Fallen needs to swap that over. He knows where that player is coming from now, at least, so the plant can be found. I like the... Oh. Mr. Fallen to begin to check this, but it has come into his head that this could be the chance! Back into D 
defaults. Nice crossfire to play with Jogamo. First point of contact, and then the swings come in, but he went a little too wide. No one able to trade out on that foot. Managed to find themselves a duel for free. Calm under pressure as well. Players starting to get close to him towards the back. Now another for foot. As they desperately try to hold on to control, EG are just being pushed back. Hardly any damage being done by this squad. Inevitable and oh, the information seemingly there. It's in with a showstopper and out of the round for Kiwi. Not a bad trade though, being able to take Jogamo down just as the trigger was pressed. So foot, they're behind. Only by one on the way back through. Post plant setup is strong though, EG grouping up inside of Lamps. That could cause major problems. Nay down in the corner. It's trying to clear out players into the open. But it's Bustio to find that frag instead. Great flash. But somehow they're still on top of it. Cracks and Mr. Fallen both finding kills. The spike now can be tapped to bait these players into the open. Ethan will be caught as the wall drops, but not eliminated. Even with a specter, he wins out that fight. And with 40 HP, Mr. Fallen surely is down and out of this round. Great damage. Seekers have been thrown through. It looks in. like they're just executing directly off the Crazy. back oh! of it. In the air, dropped down from above. Death reigns on to foot in this round. And with a Molotov burning them out, this round is already looking over. Two players remain once again. Morge and Cracks in a similar position to what we saw in the last round. Do they even go for this? It looks like they're attempting it while hiding within. He actually survived. Just about. Yeah, 7 HP, but that might deter you from going for this any further. Even the Viper's Pit down. It, or, well, it's online. It's not going to go down in this round, though. Not with that low of HP. Cracks has to open this one wide open for the squad, and he's caught Ethan. Okay, now there's an actual chance. They've seen the barrel in the corner. Demon one is down, and Calm miles away. They'll get this half before he even emerges around the corner. That's an easy kill onto the planter, just one HP. A fight now baited, but Calm, he is biting all the time they need. Control over the orb, which is exactly what you want when Jogamo is one away from a showstopper. That's what I thought, but actually they're just looking straight towards the site. Get that orb from a fight. Jogamo's being consistent with it so far. Bustio doing it for the first. But here's a showstopper oh. on the other side. And low HP. Jogamo on five. The nade has hunted him down. Yeah, Demon One's able to duck out of there, but the other players are left stuck around. Com's going to be spammed out through the wall as well. And now, oh, well, we saw a crispy 3K earlier. He's going to need to find himself for 50 seconds left. He's got time to play with. Waiting for that Viper screen to fade. But there's still so much left to find. They know he's still around this angle. Look at to peek him all together. The rest of the squad now. You've got to wonder what else do they have. And I really didn't think we'd see that committed right now. The orbital strike and the showstopper used in a round they didn't fully invest in the rifles fallen. for. They've got a molly for the post plant. Mr. Fallen goes down. He didn't get it half. That's a key detail because now Foot going to really feel the pressure of that clock. Up close, Cracks is dealt with. Another for Bustio. The same molly. And the snake bite down makes it so easy. Position. <laughs> Tiger through. Clearing out all of this space, and well, they have, oh no! That shot to Kiwi! That might just have sealed their fate, because now they should go rotating, <laughs> drifting towards that other side. Uh, whoops, whoops. <laughs> oh, that's oh. amazing from Jogamo! I don't know if you'll see a kill like that ever again! He blows packs a boom bar and then spams him through the wall! That is ridiculous! And now, just leaving two players standing between them. Impressive stuff as they all wrap back around. The orbital strike to delay, but it's left all on to Adakap. Did one man standing, and he stands no more. EG will take themselves into the playoff stage as they 2-0 this series.